Hello, I'm Tim McKibben, CEO of the Real Estate Institute of New South Wales. This is my monthly update wherein I will try to give you a brief overview of some of the contemporary issues affecting the profession. Sydney was recently determined by an international survey to be the second most unaffordable city in the world to buy a home, second only to Hong Kong. This is not a silver medal we want. It is predicted by a number of respected property analysts that Sydney's medium house price will push through 650000 during 2011, making home ownership even more unattainable. Despite housing supply and affordability being of significant importance to all of us, and a key electoral issue, neither the New South Wales Government nor opposition have made known their solution to this problem. In the lead up to the state election, the entire New South Wales electorate will be looking to both political parties for a solution to the rental crisis and housing shortage throughout New South Wales. A long-term roadmap including a review of the current planning framework, property taxes and government incentives for investors will be a key electoral issue. On a related issue, the Residential Tenancies Act 2010 is now operative. Whilst we were successful in altering the course of the legislation from its original destructive course, there are nevertheless a number of issues that continue to give us concern. What is certain is that we desperately need investors in this market and the new Residential Tenancies Act will not encourage that. There is therefore much work to be done in this area. On a brighter note, commercial property in Sydney CBD recovered strongly in 2010 after its losses in 2009. The anecdotal evidence is that this strong performance is continuing in 2011. As the year shapes up to be a strong one for our industry, REI will build upon our success of 2010 and continue to lead the way through 2011 with industry leading products, training and support for our members. To find out more, go to the website or find us on Facebook. Thank you.